Hey, what's going on guys? PSV here and welcome back to part 2 of the PSV trucking business and basically we're going to be doing another journey it's a bit of a longer journey this time it's a little bit of a uh, longer video for yourselves uh, this video I'm going to be driving from let's pull up the map Felix though, where we finished off our uh, first journey in part one, heading up to uh, Birmingham. So basically, it's a new place, so it'll be a new place to discover on the map in the UK. So let's plan our route, shall we? First of all, just going to jump inside my cab. Please just start everything up. Right, stop the engine again. I just wanted to check to see how much fuel I had. I couldn't remember what my fuel level was like, so uh, just had to double check. Okay, so let's plan the route. So the route is going to go, I'll see, out of Felix though, onto the A14, is that? Yeah, joining onto the A14. Then heading all the way up, coming off on, no, it carries on to the A14. The whole way. Pretty simple. When we're coming, oh, we're going to the M6 here, but then we come off there. <laughs> Pretty simple journey, pretty straight journey. I would have preferred it if it was more of a bendy road and stuff, but it's all cool. It's all cool. Okay, so let's start a truck up. So let's see what we're taking. We are taking 22 tons of large tubes, so it should pull. It should be a little bit tricky to pull, but not too hard. Um, We've got loads of time to do the delivery and stuff. I'm trying to remember whereabouts we are, right? UK. God, the roads are well quiet. So, yeah, I hope everyone is well. And um, part one actually wasn't too bad. I released it two days ago from the making of this video. This will probably be probably three days when you're watching this video. And the last time I checked, it was over 30 views. Well, again, it sounds a bit pathetic, but I appreciate 30 views. It's better than no views. For a channel my size, that's actually quite good. And literally, I just want to grow my channel as much as I can because I want to sh show like all my entertainment to as many viewers as possible. And bloody hell. Apparently, I've hit this wall. Great start, PSV. Great start. I forgot it's a little bit wider than the truck, the trailer. So again, guys, I'm using the Logitech G27. So if there is any rumbling noise within the microphone, I can only apologise for that. Um, it's a bit of a letdown. I was going to do a Logitech G27 webcam within these videos. But for some reason, my webcam's being a bit of a pain um, and not recognising for some reason. I don't understand why. It used to work absolutely fine until I hit record, then of course everything goes wrong. Just like normal with my computer. What's well, starting to do my head in. So not only uh, was I going to add a webcam, I was going to start a new series with the Logitech with a new game. But I can't really release that series until I get the webcam working. So that's been put on hold until I've sorted the webcam out. After I've made this video, obviously I'm recording the video right now. After I've recorded the video, I'm going to uh, try and get the webcam working. If I do get it working, I'm going to start recording this new series. Yes, another new series that I think will go quite well. Nicely on my channel. It's quite a cool game. Um, and it kind of involves people's opinion as in like they kind of get an option of what to choose in the next video I'm not going to give it too much away because a bit of a little surprise but I'm not got a release date for that at the moment because obviously I still need to record it etc but first we need to get this webcam working if worse comes to worse I may have to just purchase a new webcam but that's that so let's get on to the truck obviously we're still in our basic Scania building up our company um, I have been trying to do a few jobs offline but I haven't done any since the last series so the money hasn't really changed in that way but I don't want to do 
jobs offline that I'm going to discover new places because I want you to discover the business discovering new places if you know what I mean so I don't want to do it offline and then you come on my part 3 for example and you'll be like oh when did you go to Edinburgh I didn't see that it's not really part of the series I want to be discovering new places on the series so it's a bit difficult <laughs> but yeah I'm trying to get as much money as I can and do it all legitly 39,000 at the moment is not too bad considering I have just paid off the massive bank loan before I started this series so that's not too bad i um, quite happy with that hang on a minute hang on a minute what is it doing look at the map it's taken me through the service station and then back onto the A14 might as well just follow it straight up it's a bit pointless okay that doesn't really make any sense to me we're going to ignore the map for a minute Come on, truck. You can definitely feel it pulling because obviously it's only a small engine, basic Scania. Um, you can definitely feel it pulling, as in not getting to speed as quickly as normal. Like, I'm only doing 35 miles per hour, and I'm in like gear 11. Let me just drop it down and get the revs going. This is not good. Definitely, guys, the next customization I need to do to my lorry is put a bigger engine in so we can take these loads a bit more quicker. I do believe that's what we need to do next. So that's going to be our next target of what we're going to do. So yeah, it's just that's so weird. That was definitely so weird. Don't understand why it done that. So I hope you all enjoyed uh, enjoying this sort of idea of a series. I really enjoy making it, and as much as I enjoy making it, I enjoy playing this game as well. And to try and show you the experience of playing it and growing the business obviously in a few episodes time probably in a handful of episodes time so we've got our money up I will then consider making the uh, getting a new truck maybe I don't know probably be the be your decision of what truck I'll get um, probably I don't know probably another Scania or a Volvo or something like that but that's an idea of what I want to do then I'll hire a driver to have this truck if you know so then I can get an income from the driver that's my next plan I want to try and get the drivers as soon as possible so we're getting a bit more of an income not just our own work oh swaying a little bit there a bit too much uh, black current as I'm drinking right now <laughs> oh god I am all over the place what's going on I hope I don't drive this when I'm uh, driving my car there we go, so we're finally getting our speed up now. As you can see, nicely, you get a nice gentle pace of speed. It's always really nice. Slowly tracking it along. So we've got 113 miles left of this journey. It's currently Tuesday, at, uh, Tuesday 6.35 so in the morning so it's going to be a lovely day drive this is hopefully a nice lovely day drive so we're going to last time it did finish in the night and it's a bit of a pain driving in night because you can't really get to see much you only get to see a certain distance it's not really much fun to watch night driving in the video I prefer the day because you get to see all the scenery and all that cool stuff let me just check something so we're getting 6,257 for this job. It's okay. It's okay, I guess. We could do with bigger jobs to get more of an income quicker. But obviously, guys, as you all know, if I do do bigger jobs, I am going to then do it in two parts. I'm not going to release a video that's massive, you know, so a massive long video. Oh, don't know why I'm indicating. So as in it may be the start for example start a part three if it's a massive job that will be cut and then be part four if you know because obviously jobs can take hours and hours to do in this game it depends how big it is the job and you're not going to be able to want to sit there and just stare at a screen watching me play euro truck for an hour or something for a whole journey it'd be cool if I cut it in parts if it is an incredibly long journey then it could get cut up to like three or four parts it depends how long it is 
so that's really my idea of doing the long journeys so let's just have a little look at the signs I'll head in the right way on the A14 do need to get over though after this car like so so a new bit of road that we've just discovered as well so that's all cool more of the map also guys I hope you're liking the mod review series that I'm doing at the moment that's quite cool I'm uh, gonna make another cool video of some mods but I'm going to twist it up a little bit instead of it being trucks maybe do some like different trailers and stuff but that's on the plan so another thing I wanted to cover in this video is different topics that I've got in mind and how what I'm going to be doing on the series and I want you to comment down below if you think it's a good idea or a bad idea also I've got this series that I am going to be starting very soon with the Logitech webcam that is I'm not saying nothing about that because I don't want to say yeah it's going to be out and then it don't come out for quite a while but touch wood if everything actually goes to plan for once it will be out very very soon um, also what else have we got planned I, um, I was considering about doing a Minecraft series I don't really know if that's going to take off because I was going to start a Minecraft channel with uh, just a few friends of mine but it's not really a big game for me as in it don't really take off my channel so unless you guys desperately want to see some Minecraft then I can do that but that's that's more of a no than a yes at the moment in time but the opinion can change joining back onto the A14 now so we've got what else have we got planned? I've got some cool mod reviews planned. There's uh, quite a few mods listed up. Okay, it was actually a bit of a random thing. I was sitting in my last uh, lesson at college and for some reason it kind of just sprung in my mind some cool video ideas. I don't know why. I don't know how doing college work made me spring some video ideas. It's just so random how my mind works. But it kind of has given me some ideas now to cover. Uh, so they're some quite cool ideas. I'm not really going to announce them yet because obviously you've still got a lot of... They're not going to be any time soon. I think at the moment what I'm going to concentrate on is obviously the Euro Truck series and hopefully this new series if I can get everything working. If not it will just be Euro Truck, the mod reviews and maybe chuck in a few other little games or tutorials as in when they are needed. So I need to get over I think, yeah. Do I need to get over or this is... Oh, no. I don't need to get over. My bad. Or do I need to... Yeah. No. I oh, know because it slipped slip right off. My bad. <laughs> Excuse me there, guys. Didn't really have a... Lost my bearings a little bit of where I was going. That's why you should read the road signs. But... I'm sure now I'm coming off the slip road. Just to be honest, I need to move over now. And that's how we truck. So, left of the journey, 54 miles. God, it goes quick when you are uh, talking and recording a video. It does go pretty quick. Hour and 22 minutes game time left, so probably about uh, 8 or 9 minutes left. Because I have noticed um, it's about 6 minutes, an hour, uh, 6 minutes real time to an hour in game time. I think it's like three seconds per uh, second in game as well. Like one, two, three. Maybe not. I thought it was about, it's about six minutes an hour, unless they've adjusted it. It's when I got bored one day actually doing a journey, I actually calculated it out in my head. Yeah, it's about three seconds per game second, if you know what I mean. So three real seconds to a second in game. Cool. I've just noticed as I'm kind of talking, I'm doing some proper funny hand movements while talking. It's such a weird thing to do. If you had the Logitech webcam on, you'd probably be laughing. Just like, you know, you just talk away and my hands just go all over the place, all over. <laughs> For a fact, I do need to get over. 
And I know that for a fact. Are you going to be nice and let me out? No, of course you're not. Of course you're not. You're a transit driver. Bad bit of driving. Very, very bad bit of driving that was. But it's all cool. It's all cool, ladies and gentlemen. Don't worry about that. So, we're on our, as they call it, happy hour. Your last hour of your journey or your, uh, if you're at work, your last hour. <laughs> Containing of 33 miles. 32. Oh, I thought I was going to hit that car then, so I was swerving a little bit. Because obviously I'm going a little bit over the speed limit. I better slow down the speed camera in there. Can't be taking the fines now, can we, ladies and gentlemen? Really can't afford the fines when we're trying to grow our business. Obviously, these are, this is where it annoys me. Because obviously I'm doing the speed limit, yet we've got this car here, who's on the overtaking lane, yet not doing the speed limit. See what I think? And now they speed up. It just doesn't make sense to me. And now I can tuck back in. Yeah, really does uh, annoy me on the uh, how the AOA works sometimes. So what am I wanting to improve on my graph um, on my graphics? I do need to improve my graphics card so I can max everything out. As you can see, the trees look a bit naff at the moment, but I'm low with the graphics settings just due to the fact I've not got the best uh, graphics card. I've not got a high-end one. But it's just due to the fact not being able to afford it. And I do apologise guys if you did just hear that. I normally put my phone on silent but I forgot in this video. So I do apologise about that if you did hear that. So here we go. We're coming off here. Coming off on. We're nearly at our destination now. Only 13 miles away. I've got to say I do love this game. Absolutely love it. So we're going to be discovering a new location. It's always cool when you discover a new location. Another percentage of the map will be discovered. We do travel some long ass miles in our series didn't we drops down to 30 I did say to you guys that I will try and do the series as realistic as possible with speed so um, I'll try and do it as best as I can I should discover it in a minute There we go. Now discovered. That's all cool. At least we've discovered a new location. What's always cool. Do need to get over though. Because we're turning right up here. Oh. Oh, I'm getting a little bit of lag. I do apologise about that. I don't know why. My frames are dropping a little bit. Been fine the whole video. So, yeah, I do apologise about that, guys. Just casually swing the old truck around here. I'm getting to this lane. Oh, God's sake, I take these too tight for getting at the trailers a little bit wider. Cheers, fella. I'll just squeeze in this gap behind you. Nice, gentle wind.
there we go. Nicely done roundabout. Make sure I don't go up here with my trailer. Take it a bit wider. Wow. Wow. Haven't you heard about giving way to the right? Clearly not. Oh wow. That really annoys me. Because that's just the AI fault. Yet one, we get ticket for it. And two, now we get right to our destination and it's going to look like we've done such crap delivery. It really does frustrate me when that happens. That weren't even our fault, to be honest. They should be given away to us. Now, that crashed into the side of me. So they obviously pulled out as we was going past them. trying to straighten up the trailer as much as I can. Here we go, now on part one I did put this trailer as straight as possible. Uh, get it in first, that is in like park up the trailer first time. Don't think we're going to be as lucky on part two. No, we don't want to skip. We want to do it logistic. logistic. Oh, I think we're going to do it in two parts. Yes, we have. And that's even nicely. That's even more nicely parked than the first time. Oh, I don't know why I'm starting the video again. Oh, the video, the uh, engine. So we didn't get none taken off for that damage. We're all good. So now we have 44,977. Our progress history is not too bad. It's getting there slowly. We're now up here. Try and get up as best as I can. So yeah guys. Thanks ever so much for watching this video. Really do appreciate you. Watching the video and tuning in. Please if you haven't already check out part 1. I'm sure you have to know about part 2. <laughs> but if you did enjoy the video. Please be sure to give it a thumbs up. And yeah guys. I'll see you in my next video. Uh -huh.